video games. They can be a lot of fun and can seem like a great way to pass time. But like most forms of fun, playing video games can take over your life in ways you don't want. For example, at Ephesians 5, 15, and 16, the Bible says to make the best use of your time. So if you're up when you should be sleeping, then who's in control? You or the game? That doesn't make you a winner. Think about it. If you lose money, you may be able to get it back. But that's not true when you lose time. In a sense then, time is more valuable than money. So don't let yourself be robbed. Do you find yourself skipping meals? not doing homework, and generally not taking care of yourself in order to get through endless levels in your game? How can you stop losing out on those important parts of life? Is your gaming console in your bedroom? Move it out so you can get some sleep. At times, it might be good to take a break. Why not stop playing for a week? Replace gaming with something active. You know, actual exercise. Come to think of it, you might want to do some of that every day. At Ecclesiastes 3.4, the Bible says that there's a time to laugh and a time to dance. So it's okay to spend some time playing video games. Just not all the time. There's something else video games can rob you of. Your sense of right and wrong. The Bible says that God hates anyone loving violence. The fact is, video games promote lots of things the Bible condemns. Violence, immoral sex, and spiritism. Is it just a game? Imagine you were doing that in real life. You know, all that stuff in the game you're playing. What kind of person would you be? Your choice in video games may say a lot about who you are and what you think is right and wrong. What about online games that connect you with other players? Do you know who's on the other end? Your game could be putting you with the wrong people. It's definitely worth taking a look at your gaming habits. The bottom line? Playing video games can be good recreation. But don't let games rob you of your time or your sense of right and wrong. Instead of trying hard to be a winner in a game, use your time and energy to be a winner in real life.